What's up, TP4E family? family? It is your page. And it's your boy, Sid. And we are back with another look for you guys. We back, you guys. If you haven't, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you guys keep that notification bell on and ring it. Make sure you guys come back for more videos. Come back for more videos. <laughs> Yeah, so as y'all see today, uh, we wanted to come to you and, and give y'all uh, an update. Yeah, give y'all an update on you know, your boy Koa. Koa. So y'all, today, um, we'll be updating y'all because of course, like we've been updating, and y'all gonna see like the full entire journey and full the full entire journey of Koa. But um, today is October twenty eighth, and Koa has his heart surgery November fourth. Keep us in your prayers. I'm no, I we know everything, but. He knows him first, he has his pre-op, and the pre-op is basically like, of course, prepping him for his surgery, which is will be on that Monday, which is- Y'all, if y'all haven't, uh, y'all haven't seen the video, I'm not sure, it's probably gotta go back, but mm -hmm. we talked about the condition he has. Yes. He has a heart condition called TOF, um, it's Tethology of Fallout. Yeah, so- A fallout, I'm sorry, I always say fallout, but it's fallout, it's felt like fallout. And basically, like with that condition, it'll be like adding like a tube. Hope I'm saying it right. Like adding like a tube, but he can like breathe. You know, like he breathes normal, but like two parts of his heart. So you have the blood flow. You have the what is the other? I can't even. So you got the blood and the oxygen. Oxygen. And yeah, he need to be able to up the party a little bit more so mm -hmm. that it could actually go blending together yeah, through the other side. Yeah. So uh, it's very mild. Yes. yes. So we you thank know. you for that. <clears throat> yep. Yeah, so uh, you have go check that out. Uh, we. Talked about it in previous videos about his update. But it's getting closer to like surgery date, and yeah. I think it's just kind of like we came back. We just came back from Vegas, so you probably seen that video before this one. But the fact that it's getting like close to surgery date is like I'm nervous, you know. But I mean, I know things are gonna go great, but it's just normal to be like, yeah, my baby is like six months going to. So yeah. And it and it's for the better. So it ain't like, you know, he's gonna be the same young man he's gonna be. Uh, I think nothing's gonna change. Yeah, so it's just to get him to make sure he live the best life live, you know. Long term. It's, he got good supporting parents, uh grandparents and family, friends, so uh And that day everybody's supposed to be there. So yep. a lot of people gonna be there waiting in the lobby until he's done and make sure he's good and stuff and yeah that's gonna be a long day because we don't know how long we're gonna be like in NICU so apparently we're supposed to probably be in NICU for about either 7 to 7 to 14 days and of course like Cole's not staying in NICU by himself like Sadie and I are gonna be there well I think he's gonna be in NICU well I see you for probably like maybe the first couple of days and then they gonna his own little area <laughs> Well, his own area is gonna be NICU. That's when they watch him, like they're watching him closely. He's mm -hmm. gonna be That's there for, you know you said? Days. At least his first three days, four days. No, I think he's gonna be in NICU the whole time. Oh, she, she said he's gonna be in, coming out of surgery day. Okay. And probably, yeah, maybe three or four days. That's probably gonna be a week, his first week. Mm -hmm. and then they're gonna push him out to where, you know, be in his own little room, you know, like a regular patient. Uh, Checking on him, making sure his vitals and all that is good. Yeah. And then I think week three, he'll be able to come home, God's willing. I don't think he's staying that long. They said that three to seven days, and basically, like, if he's good within that front time, he can go home. And they said that, but they usually tell their patients, like, seven to 14 days just in case. Well, anything happens. Anything happens. Yeah, I'm, I'm that type of person. But we leave. Because pregnancy and surgery, yeah, I ain't never had neither one of them. It's major to me. I never had surgery either, so it's crazy yeah. that Cole is I just surgery. Right. I just want to make sure that he leaves with everything he got before we come home because... We don't need no reviews yeah, to we turn don't around. Need no nothing, 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 nothing. So I need y'all to uh, put my boy in prayers, support us uh, if you haven't, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Y'all still on this journey, I promise you. I feel like uh, we got to let the world see him. And he got a story to tell, so it's only our job and responsibility to make sure that to make sure that he gets his story out there. And yeah, he's gonna be incredible, be incredible young man. Yeah. So I'm excited about pushing forward uh, with recovery. What we're looking forward to. So basically, like we did talk to the doctor, and um, big hungry so. And I was gonna record that process, but I just feel like that was too personal. So basically, we how you think about it? Hey, thinky, thinky, thinky. Uh, so basically, we talked to the doctor. Said and I both had our little Zoom call with him, and everything went great. Like we was, we felt so confident. He answered all our questions. He even gave us his number. <laughs> he even gave us his number, like to contact him after hours and stuff. Like if we had any questions. So yeah, and we've been to Children's. So Children's is like legit. They're so good, and they were so nice and kind. You ready? Think about you ready to get through this. 
And uh, really the only uh, understanding and thing that we don't have to work with is getting him to figure out and understand uh, about his scar situation because yeah. his scar going to grow with him as he get older. But I just want him to continue to be active and we just getting prepared for yeah, him getting back healthy fully. So, but I think we're going to do just great. He's going to do amazing. So, his scar is going to be from like the top of the tailbone to like the bottom. So, like right above his stomach. And the doctor said that basically like his scar is going to grow with him. So, mm -hmm. said and I thought the scar was going to shrink as he got older because I just feel like that kind of makes sense. But, no, the doctor said the older he get, it will stretch out. So. Yeah, we... We, uh, you know, yeah, there's so much research out there, you know, on skincare that, you know, we, we already aware of. So hopefully thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. we could help him, you know, feel better about his scar as he get older. Mm -hmm. But I just want my boy to be healthy and a happy person. Be baby. And y'all see. He's such a happy baby. Just. Give me a thing. You were just so lit, man. Just up, y'all. Up. Mm -hmm. Boo, boo. Why are you so lit? You up, doogie. You up. You gonna tell the people? Ooh, oh. Oh, a good work. There we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That was great. You gonna tell the people how you gonna kick butt with this surgery? Say, I'm gonna kick butt. Yay, yay, yay. Yeah, we just want to come out here and let you guys know, like, keep y'all, you know, in tune on what's really going on and... Of course, like drop some content for you guys. Y'all are family to us, so we're gonna literally show y'all the process. Yep. So uh yeah, y'all just stay tuned, stay uh uh in good vibes, good thoughts, positivity, mm -hmm. cold. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do. Really appreciate it. We do not it don't go on scene. So I notice. Yeah. Unseen or notice. Unseen or notice, whatever. But uh yeah, we we got some work to do. Uh, gonna go ahead and get some videos going for y'all. Uh, continue to stay consistent. Yeah. And yeah, y'all check out your boy. Okay, he's so happy. Yeah. <laughs> check out your boy. So. We haven't seen him in three days, so mm -hmm. he's like, "Mama, dad, y'all back." Check out your boy. So yeah, mm -hmm. my boy. We we will make sure that cameras stay rolling at all times. I want him to look back on these memories and like. You like my parents have recorded this for me. Even not maybe not all the footage might go in. You know, I just want him to be able to have like this footage and put it on like a little SD card for him. So when he get older, he can watch the process and do that. Mommy and Daddy was one playing about you. Yeah. yeah. But we love you guys. Thank y'all so much for tuning in to this vlog and tuning in to all our videos. We appreciate y'all so much. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully y'all can tune in. Hopefully y'all got that notification bell on and ringing. Yep. So we see y'all in the next video. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what this means. What that mean, baby? Uh, see you later. You did. Peace. Peace.